Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing another Dollar Tree DIY for you guys. You guys seem to be really liking these Dollar Tree DIYs. So I'm making three different projects and these are going to be a farmhouse, rustic, inspired look to them. So let's just get right into them. Alright guys, and for the first project, these are the materials we'll be needing. A paintbrush, white paint, a small candle, and this one is in the shape of a small terracotta pot. A ribbon, this has a little lace material. And this floral stem that I picked up from the floral section. Scissors, hot glue, and some floral moss. And to start this project off, what I did is I went ahead and I lit the candle, soften up the wax so it makes it easier for it to pop off. So next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab the white paint and we're gonna go ahead and just kind of give this like a light brush, kind of like a whitewash. Put as little or as much paint as you like. Alright guys, and for the next step here, I forgot to push record, but all I did here was I um, just put a little hot glue and then I hot glued this ribbon all the way around the little pot here. Now we're going to grab our floral moss and we're just going to Fill it in like that. And then we're gonna trim these little green leaves and we're just gonna go ahead and insert them. And this is the end result to this project. Alright guys, and I'm going to go ahead and set my little pots into this little tray here. I do have a video where I explained how I did this in my Valentine's DIY, so if you're interested, go ahead and check that out. But all it is is a picture frame, and then I went ahead and I just painted that back of it. And I'm going to go ahead and use this to display the little pots that I made. So three of them fit perfectly into the little tray. Okay, and for the next project, we're gonna be using one of these small floral foams. And this one is in the 2.8 inch. Another of the little candle pots here. Some reindeer moss. Some wooden dowels. The black shoe polish to stain the wood dowels. A ribbon, and I'm using the lace ribbon scissors, and hot glue. Now to get started on this project, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna light the candle. And what this is gonna do is just gonna soften up the wax a little bit so that I can insert the wooden dowel in there because the candle wax is what we're using to hold the little wooden dowel. So I'm gonna go ahead and start staining this with the black shoe polish. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna insert the little wooden dowel in the center. Like that. Now I'm gonna go ahead and then I'm gonna hot glue this ribbon all the way around. And that's how that looks. Next, we're gonna grab our foam and we're gonna insert it. So it's gonna look like this. Next, with our reindeer moss, we're gonna start hot gluing it.
that you've checked to make sure that all of it is fully covered and there's no spots missing is I'm gonna grab my scissors and I'm just gonna start trimming it just to give it a nice round even shape. All right guys, and this is the final look to this one. And for our last project, we're gonna be using four packs of these doilies, scissors, and hot glue. So now that we have our two doilies here, I removed the tags, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and make sure that they are connected as straight as possible, because what we're gonna do is we're gonna just go ahead and start hot gluing them together, and this is how we're gonna create our runner. So for my table, I went ahead and then I used one, two, three, four, five, six. Six of these. video I really hope you guys enjoyed these three dollar tree DIYs please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new and don't forget to hit that little bell button so you guys get notified every time I make a new video comment down below if you have any questions and also don't forget that I'm gonna be announcing the winner this coming Monday so stay tuned to that and I will see you guys on my next video bye